Fair enough. Hello and welcome to the Italian Grand Prix press conference. Tonight, uh, we are here with uh, SV Custard, SV Bradford, SV Fridays, hey. SV Skyline and SV Tony. And we will be hearing from uh, Ramsey at the end. Uh, we're going to come to... We're going to Bond, I think. Uh, oh, I bet. Obviously, you know why you're here. Of course uh, I do. Obviously, you were in a very good position uh, last... Well, the last time out. And then you got absolutely killed by uh, SV Pabu. Um, I hope you did it in Pabu's audio. <sighs> oh, thank God for that. Uh, but yeah, just uh, give us a few words on what happened uh, with that incident. Uh, well, um, it, it is what it is, you know, these things kind of happen in racing every now and then, you know, um, I was, uh, I was trying to hang it around the outside of John, he was on fresh tyres, so I was on worn tyres, and, um, you know, I just tried to keep, uh, rounders outside, but crashed into me and took me out of the race, but, oh, well, it is what it is, you know, um, got to kind of let these things slide every now and then, um, because it does happen that every now and then a driver does run out of talent, but um, <laughs> <laughs> just uh, that was the wrong time looking to take forward a trip. to <laughs> just looking forward to basically, um, where I can get my revenge on John. Uh, obviously, talking about Italy, uh, what can we expect from you in, uh, at the Italian Grand Prix? <laughs> um, well, for starters, you could be uh, hey, expecting hey. to take John out of Batter. the um, No, no I'm <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, Italy's like the first all right track for me out of um, the season so far, so I'm hoping yeah. to maybe aim for the top five. Um, and if I don't get taken out by some random twat, maybe a podium. But it is what it is. Yeah, okay, thank you very much. You need to change uh, that with so much to... filth. <laughs> uh, next we'll come to uh, SV Fridays, uh, obviously you picked up your first podium uh, in your uh, debut race, um, obviously <laughs> uh... <laughs> Alright, I know I'm a show, but it's still out bro uh, <laughs> uh, It's just a prank bro Obviously picked up a podium, <laughs> will you lot shut up, I'm trying to do it <laughs> uh, obviously, you picked up a podium in your first race. Um, obviously, you must be feeling pretty happy with the start of your season. Um, but yeah, what is your uh, mind frame going into the race? First off, not to get last. That's that's a given. And second, not to spin about seven times. Anything else? I don't think I'm forgetting anything. No, I don't think so. Okay, uh, we're good. Just last question for yourself. Um, obviously, the Italian Grand Prix just around the corner. Uh, what can we see from yourself? If I don't bottle it every four laps, maybe points. If not, well, you know, I think um, I am 15th. <laughs> Fair enough. All right. <laughs> well, all right. I mean, if I did, I would... <coughs> Spin every four seconds, so yeah, I would kindly appreciate if you would pass me that <laughs> fucking picture, you fuck. Okay. <laughs> Cheers, some for the rest next of us. We'll... Brad. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, next, we'll come Ooh. to uh, Brad. Um, hello, hello. Obviously, uh, I need to look. Where did you finish? I forgot. I finished second because I'm a plus. Oh, I finished second. Uh, obviously, decent amount of uh, points for yourself. Obviously, uh, not at the lower end of the. Uh, obviously you took the lead of the championship so I mean that's uh, one thing uh, what can you do from now until the end of the season to keep that ch championship alive well the the only thing I can do is just try and stay in front of uh, my closest rivals which is uh, my teammate and uh uh, Elias, Elias and uh, Jotter, if he can manage to actually finish a race from DNF in the last two races, which... Tell me another joke. <laughs> <laughs> I've got loads. I've uh, wrote some on my hand. My um, needs to uh, get Brett qualifying. Uh, needs to play the game a bit more. Um, do you want me to carry on? Oh, I'm joking. Um, 
just need to try and just get my act together and qualifying and the start of the races where because that's what I lose most on um, especially uh, in the rain where a lot of the tracks are going to be raining and past experiences I'm not very good uh, in the rain in the slightest um, and then it's just oh, we'll that. strategy and consistency it, to be honest because halfway through the race I just lose pace and you need pace throughout the whole race to get those points coming in for the team and yourself. So, yeah. Yeah. Obviously, um, your teammate didn't finish. Well, he did finish, but not very high. I think he... After everything, all the confusion stuff happened, I think he <clears> finished 10th. <throat> but he did have fastest lap, so he did pick up two points. Still leading uh, the constructors. Uh, I'm not really sure what the gap is behind, but... Uh, um, a large amount, that's all I'm saying, because... Uh, until Silverstone, John had talent. Whoa! So, <laughs> anyone else want to bully John today? Anyone else? <laughs> we got the audience uh, in this. Can anyone much, else Brad. bully John? Uh, we'll go to uh, S. We'll go to SV Tony <laughs> if you're there. Yeah, I'm here. Just good evening. Uh, picked up points last week. Uh, not last week. Last time out, I believe you picked up eighth after everything. Um, so some pretty decent points for yourself and Alpha. I know with your teammate finishing in, I believe, the top six. Uh, where can we see you uh, finishing? No, see, if you'd, if you'd have asked me this at six, six o'clock tomorrow night, I'd have been able to tell you so I'm doing it again tonight, but I have no idea. Oh. <laughs> <Fair enough. laughs> I mean... Probably in the barrier somewhere. I was about to say, Most probably likely. retired on track, uh, somewhere with and Tony, uh, three last wheels. last question for you. Uh, would you like us to bring back the interviews during qualifying? Uh, keep asking about it. Yeah, yes, because he's like got what? fuck all else to do throughout Q2. <laughs> <laughs> there you go then, I'll bring him back just for you, there you go. Just for me, uh, Thank you very me. much, Tony. Uh, we'll go to the... The new boy, I uh, hope you all have actually included your audios. Uh, Nathan, yeah, yeah. Um, obviously, f be your first race tomorrow. Uh, uh, yeah, hopefully. Not yeah. had any uh, league racing experience, so it's going to be a bit of a learning curve. Yeah, um, de definitely, yeah. Just, I mean, I don't really know what kind of questions to ask you, obviously you're new and everything, but uh, what are you looking forward to the most for tomorrow? I mean... I I I watch most like pretty much most of the races that uh, you guys do anyway, so it will be interesting to see if I can at least keep up with the lads. I'll probably end up crashing myself. I mean, I've had a practice in the cars and uh, round the tracks and stuff like that, so I'm definitely getting there. It's just I actually having the experience in the actual race and seeing how I get on. Okay, and last question for yourself: uh, Who would you say is your closest rival? Oof, that's... Whoever does it crash first. That is a that? very... Yeah. Uh, how's he supposed to know? He's not roasting against anyone, I don't think. Okay, who would you like You're to new. be your closest right. rival? There you go. Well, I mean, I've seen, like, John, Brad and Ben all brilliant races. Yeah, uh, all, all very <laughs> fast. <laughs> all very fast. <laughs> all very fast races. Definitely John and Brad. Um, Sorry, but I I'd probably yeah, we'll say like. You use. I mean, I I don't know about That's rivals, a... but I definitely like to see how I'd like get on against some of like the fast drivers. I mean, I don't think I'd actually do well against them, but I'd like to. I don't think I'd say rivals. I'd just say if I could as keep up and compete with a lot of the drivers. Okay, thank you very much. And uh, last, we're going to hear from uh, Ranzi, who is uh, answered my questions. Who is non-existent so, uh, in this part? Yeah, he is online, to be fair, but I think he's away from his Xbox. So uh, the questions I asked him, he's kept it short and sweet, so that's all right. I uh, said another solid amount of points at Britain. Are you looking forward to Italy? He's like, yeah, I like Italy, so looking forward to it. But then I asked him, what can we potentially see from yourself tomorrow night? He was like, hopefully, another good amount of points. I want to say thank you for everyone that's uh, watched the press conference and everyone that has participated. Obviously, we do have the Italian Grand Prix tomorrow. 
uh, live uh, at 8 p.m. Hopefully, we'll have full quality. Uh, thank you very much, and we'll see you soon. Goodbye.